by then the teacher used to give us a right to 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 should I say flog to flog kids and I didn't want that. My name is Mwayafu Joshua Jimwali. I'm a former pupil of Kigum Center Primary School. Joined in 2011, that was primary one. I was here till 2017, that was when I sat P7. As per my course through the school, we usually had a lot of fun time around the school. We had a lot of engagement in sports. We had engagement in outreach activities. We had outdoor activities. Then also, around the school we had all these fruit trees like the mango trees and then the avocado trees whereby you couldn't really say you're having a bad nutrition or a diet so that also helped us in the long run then as per being a pupil here i was a debate prefect 2015 2016 and i was head boy 2016 2017 when i left office that's when i sat for my p7 i managed to get eight aggregates by the grace of god and I'm really grateful to the school and the administration. As an old student of the school, I particularly love and appreciate the heritage here, whereby as an individual it is important to fall back and appreciate your history, your heritage, your home, because Kigumba Center is my home. It gave me the foundation to where I am as per now. Uh, right now, I, as per secondary school, I went to Hilton High Mukono. I managed to get 15 aggregates, that was senior four. Then in appreciation, as we did, as per the class of 2017, we brought by a tree that would serve for shed and then also as a linkage back to home. So for all those who came before us and all those who, came, who will come after us, if they ever get to see this, this is our home. We need to come back. We need to appreciate where we came from. We need to show appreciation for everything we got from this establishment. And above all, we need to also keep on connecting people here we also need to keep on supporting each and everyone who will ever come to this institution because this is our family, this was our first family before we got out there. Everyone wanted to come this side. So when we came this side, there used to be days like speech day, sports day, we used to bring bouncing castles. Those were days to remember. We really loved those days. And then tours. You go to Freedom City, <laughs> swim. You know, in Chigumba, we have no swimming pool. But when you go to Freedom City, you see you're really outside. Really, the tours of the school. I, I, I remember I went to all tours. <laughs> Throughout, I went to all tours. And I really enjoyed all of them. And then, after my P7, I actually got 11 aggregates from here. It's a very good background. I remember in P3, I was a class monitress. It wasn't a, a very easy duty <laughs> because by then the teacher used to give us a right to, 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 should I say flog, to flog kids and I didn't want that. So I was, I was, I was in blue, blue, Jerusalem. oh Jerusalem. Yeah, it was a very nice color. Yeah, I looked smart in it but then I loved I loved red, <laughs> but still I was. In um, as per the moment, as per the moment we are planting a tree. One, this could serve for the purpose of shade in the school, considering as it grows along, 
it broadens and also it is a link to our origin as per the old boys and the old girls of the school it is something that is clearly a memorial so that we can link back and trace it to this our place of origin and also to show our pride and thanks to the school for everything they enabled us to do and become because this is quite a strong foundation we got uh, it helps us out there when we are meeting different people and different circumstances and obstacles we use the training we, are, we attained while here out there and we emerge different and we emerge at the top yes so in appreciation we decided to plant a tree as per the class of 2017 sir